can't believe you read this rag. Pure liberal drivel. All of it. So it makes this country great, Rorschach. You can read your propaganda, I can read mine. So I can safely assume you won't be joining me at Columbia tomorrow night? For what? Those ex-Washington Post reporters Bob Woodward and Carl Bernstein are speaking. They say they've got some stunning new info on that break-in at the Watergate Hotel last June. Paranoid conspiracy theorists, both of them. Keep pecking at corpse of closed case just to advance their commie agenda. Glad they got fired. Remind me again why I waste my time trying to open your mind. You must be pathologically stubborn. Repeat, this is a police bulletin. A sudden power blackout in Austin, New York has resulted in a riot at Sing Sing Prison. All available units, please respond. Looks like politics will have to wait. Rorschach's Journal, Friday the 13th, October 1972. Raining again tonight, raining a lot lately. Like heaven is trying hard to wash away all of New York's sins. <laughs> Waste of time. Steel wool couldn't scour clean this city's soul. Sing Sing, dead ahead. Black as Moloch's heart down there. Attention, Warden. This is Night Owl. Rorschach and I request permission to land and lend a hand. Permission denied. The last thing we need right now is you damn costume vigilantes interfering and making the situation worse. We've got it under control. Not the way it looks from up here. Warden, can your men reach the backup generators? I told you we're handling things. Just stay the hell away. I'm warning you. Attempt to land, and my officers will shoot you. Fine. That's the way you want to play it. Not the warm welcome we hope for. The warden may not have rolled out the welcome wagon, but from the looks of things, it's up to us to try to help quell this riot. Rabbit dogs need to be put down. You just made a big mistake messing with me! I'm gonna take your goggles and wring your freaking neck! on backup power, but that won't last. There should be an entrance to the generator room in the next yard. Let's get over there and see if we can't get these lights back on.
Those are gods incompetent. Warden his own worst enemy. Up to us to put these animals back in their cages. So must assume backup generator has been sabotaged. Maybe, but let's not get ahead of ourselves. are in their cages. This square gets near me! Block C is locked down. We'll need to get to the guard room to allow access. I'm guessing it's got a standard double safe locking mechanism, so it'll take us both to activate it. The entire cell block's on fire. This is gonna be hell, but we've got to make it through. It's night out. Seems work never done. I hate goddamn <laughs> Hero, boy. Oh. 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 Oh.
won't be for long. Rorschach don't look like much, but I see you <laughs> and it ain't pretty. <laughs> like more assholes. <laughs> Be careful. <laughs> this is gonna hurt you. <laughs> Worst elements get put to society's concept of justice. Fair trial, jury of peers, incarceration, rehabilitation. Only thing being rehabilitated is politicians' image. Piling filth on top of filth doesn't clean anything. <laughs> security cells. Hey, I'm sure this place is surrounded by cops by now, but I'd still expect to see inmates looking for a way out. I don't see too many prisoners running for the exits. I concur. Obvious breakout opportunity. Perhaps security leak is not a perimeter. <laughs> Rorschach, I'm starting to come around to your way of thinking. It seems like there are just too many things going wrong around here at one time for this to be a coincidence. Correct. You should listen to your gut more often. You certainly will. Look out, man! shower room. But why would a fire cause it to... something doesn't feel right. I think we better investigate. <laughs> Seems like someone has orchestrated this, but I can't quite put my finger on it yet.
Typical. City couldn't get the power back on five minutes faster? No guards in sight. Not paid enough to rush head first in the slaughterhouse. Not like us, right? Well, whoever sabotaged those generators sure knew what they were keep doing. Keep your hands where I can see them, damn it! You were warned to keep out of this. I ought to arrest you both. No need to thank us. Just doing your job. I take it you've got everything under control, right, Ward? No thanks to you. But all the prisoners are back in their cells and accounted for. Except one. Which one, big figure? No. It's under boss. Him? We put that gorilla away in 66. Smarter than I remember. Used Riot to cover his escape. Must have had help. Explains the power outage. Guess it's up to us to bring him in again. You two aren't going anywhere until we sort out how much damage you're meddling for. Dr. Manhattan? And Silk Spectre, I see. Can we be of any assistance? Maybe five minutes ago. Sorry, there was a cyclone threatening Sri Lanka to be dealt with. Are you all right? Fine. Porting always makes me queasy as all. You're certain that we cannot be of service here? Nah, we were just leaving. Isn't that right, Warden? Uh, yes, absolutely. No problem. Very well. A plane carrying a Uruguayan rugby team will crash in the Andes in precisely 4 minutes 37 seconds, unless I intervene. Thank you for your concern, Knight. Blue Freak. Makes my skin crawl. He might have been able to tell us where to find Underboss. You look like you could use a drink, Daniel. Here the rum runners always open. Couldn't park any closer. Better this way. We'll draw less attention if we... Now what? No! Please! Come on, baby. This won't hurt. What a bet. Tell me again, why are we heading to Rum Runner while Underboss could be just about anywhere? Need to turn over a few rocks, see what crawls out, get information. I suppose you're right. That bar is like a halfway house for wayward ex-cons. Someone in there is bound to have a clue to Underboss's whereabouts, but we don't have a lot of time to mess around if the natives get restless. <laughs> You'd think that with Underboss on the loose, all the stool pigeons would be keeping a low profile. What if none of the usual suspects turn up at the rumble? Not a problem. There's always a new pigeon to be found at that roost. How you like <laughs> Come <laughs> on. 
If I can lift this gate, you continue on down the alleyway. I'll take the high road thanks to my grappling gun and catch up with you later. I get the feeling that these biker types feel like we're invading their territory. Safe. Now scum like this corrupts them, but scum can be cleansed. Almost a rum runner. Just another few blocks. Ah! Ah! 
Hey, two heads are better than one. If we split up, we can cover a larger area. If you can lift gate, Dan, I can get through. But you'll need alternate route. Perhaps job for grappling gun. Made it. Rum Runner is straight ahead. By the way, did I ever mention that I freaking hate bikers? I'll make <laughs>
city gets more brutal every day. Animals are taking over Zoo. Right now, we've got more important things to deal Our with. Our top story, Ozymandias has captured the notorious King of Skin. We go now to Jody Kramer on the scene for an exclusive interview with the famous crime fighter. Pathetic showboater can't resist camera. Could have been best of us. What a waste. We all have choices to make, pal. We can't condemn him for his. Can't we? <laughs> Please, man, no trouble. I just got the place patched up from the last time you was here. I can't make you any promises. Going somewhere. I, I, I don't know nothing. Honest. You never do, at first. Underboss just broke out of prison. He had outside help. Who was it? I, I got no idea. Fine, let's play some pool. You be cue ball, I'll break. No, no, wait. I'll talk! Quickly! Word is, it was Jimmy the Gimmick. He messed with the prison's power grid somehow. Not surprising. Jimmy likes to play both sides of the fence. He'll supply arms to thugs, government black ops, hell, the Girl Scouts if they pay him enough. What rock is Jimmy hiding under these days? The old amusement park, I think. You know, the one they're gonna tear down? But you didn't hear it from me, okay? I got enough trouble without... Huh? Oh, jeez. I think I wet myself. Rorschach's Journal. Industrial Dockland area. Another cesspit off beaten track. Like others, home to depraved filth. We need to find Jimmy the Gimmick. He's our best lead yet and may be able to lead us to Underboss. If that stool pigeon was right, he's camped out somewhere in the amusement park. Uh, say you're uh, of Underboss. Need to find that canary and make him sing. Looks like more assholes on the head. Be careful.
bought by shipping containers. Perhaps Crane is operational. Can you get up there, Dan? I haven't been down here at the docks for some time. From what I can see, they've really deteriorated over the last few years. Still as functional and busy during day as used to be. Yet the remote location clearly suits needs of criminal element. I got it! I think I can get up to the crane's controls and use it to move this container. Ready or not, Rorschach, here they come. We need to hit these levers simultaneously in order to activate this. I hope that finding Jimmy the Gimmick will actually lead us to Underboss. He could be anywhere by now. Then sooner we find Gimmick, the better. That's for certain. But once we find him, can we get what we need out of him? He's as shifty a character as there is. One way or another. Gimmick will come clean. Time to show these costume retards who's If you can find a way inside the building, I'll wait here and make sure the area remains secure. Once inside, see if you can get the door open.
Let's get moving. Better brace yourself. This is gonna get ugly. I think I can lift this gate enough for you to squeeze under. Find a way to open it from the other side. Right here. I'll find a way to open the door. Good to see you again, partner. Looks like more assholes up ahead. <laughs> such as these to deviate so far from society's status quo. Product of broken homes, probably. Raised in streets. So what does that say about our society and its ability to look after the less fortunate? It's the geek who tossed Dax down that elevator shaft. <laughs> 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 Dirty. Oh. Get off my oh, oh, 
Wait here. I'll find a way to open the door. Good to see you again, partner. here. Chaotic. Anarchic. What causes being such as these to deviate so far from society's status quo? Product of broken homes, probably. Raised in streets. So what does that say about our society and its ability to look after the less fortunate? wonder what's in these shipping containers. I mean, there are acres and acres of them. New York City. Millions of soft people require millions of luxury items.
This is the worst of the worst. Truly a sad display of wasted youth. What are we doing so wrong that so much innocence is lost? What is missing from these boys' lives that gang affiliation becomes their most prized possession? you're in the gang, it seems like there's just a few ways out. Prison, or worse. Sadly, for most of these punks, their gang is their one true family. Yet their greatest crime, failure to rise above and make something of themselves. Inexcusable. <laughs> Everything go okay? Problem solved. Time to move. Looks like we're 
Hostiles up ahead. Oh, no, not this guy. I freaking hate this guy. path must lead to the park entrance. Jimmy the gimmick has got to be around here somewhere, and by now he's probably expecting us. Path leads to amusement park entrance. Unfortunately for the gimmick, fun and games end now. Places to run, Jimmy. And you're starting to piss us off. Quit while you can still walk. Forget it, faceless. There's always a way out. The only way out of here is pavement. Shit! Look, wait. Uh, let's be reasonable. Forever, Jimmy. If you're gonna talk, it better be now. Okay, sure, whatever you want. Where can we find Underboss? What else? Back in his old underground hideout. Thought that property been auctioned off with the rest of his assets. Well, whoever bought it must be letting him use it, because that's where I was told to deliver the hardware. What hardware? Who told you to... I don't get it. That cable was designed to hold five times that much weight. There's no way it should have snapped on its own. Something or somebody must have cut it. Paranoid. <laughs> Still alive. For now. Let's call for an ambulance to pick up what's left of Jimmy. Any other ideas how to reach Underboss? Let's take the sewers. They're his domain. Appropriate. Somewhere. I always thought it was strange that a powerful and connected criminal like Underboss would base his operations in the sewer. But considering how long it took to locate his hideout back in the day, I guess it worked for him. That said, Underboss coming back here now seems too obvious. But it's the best lead we have. More than a lead. Gimmick was telling truth before his fall. I could see it in his eyes, hear it in his voice. Underboss escapes prison, and now somebody is delivering unknown materials to his hideout.
Jeez, these guys aren't street punks. They're trained professionals. What the hell are they doing down here? And what do they want with us? I'll lift the gate, you duck underneath. Maybe you can find a way to get some of these doors open on the other side. Motherfucker down! First one to stick him earns a bonus!
Good to see you again, Dan. Better to have someone around to watch your back, huh? Gotta take all these guys now. Can't let any of them escape to warn Underboss we're here. We're too close to lose him now. Convenient. Mercenaries don't seem interested in running anyway. I guess that's one way to look at it.
wish I would have thought twice before suggesting we take the sewer. Every time I come down here, it takes me days to get the stink out of my boots. Side and look for opening mechanism.
here, we need to find a way to lower the water line in this area. There must be a way to drain it somehow. Seems to be working, but still need to flush more water. Looks like we're on the right track, but we still need to flush more water. been thinking. Is it possible that Underboss didn't actually hire these mercenaries? I mean, could he be working with someone else? Seems possible. Breakout was coordinated. Unknown hardware being delivered to former hideout. Mercenary guards in place hours after his escape. Hmm. Partner makes sense. But something still seems wrong. I agree. I have a feeling there's more here than meets the eye.
Something's not right here. How did a slug-like underboss hire an army of mercenaries while in stir? Hey, somebody's in there. Jesus Christ. He's alive. Not for long. Who is he? Mark Felt, FBI's missing associate director. It's okay, Mr. Felt. We're gonna take care of you. Forget about me. He made me tell him. Tell where I'm supposed to meet them. Meet who? Those reporters. Woodward and Bernstein. He's going to kill them. Where? When? Construction site. 39th and Charlton. 3 a.m. He's crazy. You've got to stop him before... He's gone. Disturbing. Why would Associate Director of FBI meet secretly with those two agitators? What info did he plan to give them? And why would Underboss kill to get it? Yeah, maybe he doesn't want info. Just revenge. You're right. They wrote that series of articles that helped convict him back Freeze! Move and you die! We've been set up. And 3 a.m. is only minutes away. Only one thing we can do. Here comes Drop. This guy's got some tricks up his indiscretions on way back to prison. I'm thinking the best way to try to avoid the cops here might be to split up. Plus, if one of us is detained, at least the other may make it out of here to find Underboss. <laughs>
You think that man? <laughs> Gotta find Underboss. Not only is he an escaped convict, but he's got a lot more to answer for now. He's gotta be brought to justice. Let's get moving.
getting close to Underboss, I can feel it. Once we find that son of a bitch, there's no way he's going to escape again. He's gonna wish he hung up that mask. <laughs> <laughs> to avoid detection. Looks like more assholes. Be careful. <laughs> Definitely getting close to 39th and Charlton. Almost there. Underboss is gonna pay for his sins. Looks like we're too late to save Woodward and Bernstein. No, no, wait, you, you got this wrong. I, I didn't do this. I was set up. Like you said, I saw back at your hideout. My hideout? I, I ain't been there for years. Tell it to the judge. Not a chance. I'll die before I go back inside. Your choice.
Let's see if you two can keep up in those fancy dress outfits. <laughs> Grab under, boss. Don't let him get away. My sweet old granny runs faster than you punks. <laughs> wow. Underboss moves deceptively well for a man of his size. Prison taught Underboss to play hard to get. I'm out of here, moron. <laughs> <laughs> Calling for backup, huh? Can't say we expected a fair fight from you. Focus on Underboss. Must get away. <laughs> Think you're gonna catch me? <laughs> Doesn't matter how many goons you throw at us, Underboss. Once we get through them, you'll be the next to fall. If you're not too busy, Would someone about a little help. just execute these motherfuckers. Show them what happens when they mess with the Underboss. All right, then. It's your choice, mister. One way or another, you're coming with us. Warshak, we can't hit Underboss in the back. He's protected by his gear. Try to get some good combos in. Watch out for his counterattack. <laughs> Giant step from me. Just try and keep up if you can. Give it up, heroes. It's all over. More lackeys. Just delaying inevitable. Try and take out Underboss. Don't worry about the rest of them. You can see me. Henchman easily dispatched. Your time is coming, Underboss. Don't cross the 
Underboss, don't let him get away. Underboss, why don't you give it up? Just kill weapon won't help. Gonna shred you and smoke you. Whoa! Look out for the flamethrower. Stay yourself. away from flames. Gonna get them. We gotta get Underboss to come to us. Try to get him off balance. Maybe try to throw some henchmen at Underboss. I kill you, hero. Face it, but Underboss, you're out of your league. Never mind the other guys. Take down Underboss first. Hired help. Minor annoyance at best. Get down, mask. <sighs> you ain't so scary now. <laughs> getting clobbered over here. <laughs> you just bought yourself some <laughs> shoes, Warshack. <laughs> in the back. He's protected by his gear. Try to get some good combos in, but watch out for his counterattack. Stay down. Grab under boss. Don't let him get away. Try and take out Underboss. Don't worry about the rest of them. Uh-oh. <laughs> for greens. <laughs> Henchman easily dispatched. Your time is coming, Underboss. <laughs> Grab Underboss. Don't let him get away. Incoming! Drop weapon under boss. Fight like a man. 
You're grasping at straws, underboss. Why don't you give it up? Technique sloppy. Weapon will help. Look out for the flamethrower. Gotta stay away from flames. Maybe these guys are... Gotta get Underboss to come to us. Try to get him off balance. Maybe try to throw some henchmen at Underboss. Never mind the other guys. Take down Underboss first. Hired help. Minor annoyance at best. Hold still so I can take a look at your ass. Let's go, big man. You've got a lot to answer for. I'm telling you, you got the wrong guy. The person you should be looking for is... Oh. <laughs> Amateurs. See anything? Nothing. Whoever took out Underboss is long gone. Why didn't he fire on us? We were wide open. Obvious. We weren't his targets. Whatever just happened here, we've been played. Played hard. Rorschach's Journal, November 8th, 1972. Three innocent men dead. What's left of those two scumbags is still breathing. 
Tricky Dick is back in White House, and the world is once again safe for democracy. But for how long? How long until day dawns when good men like Night Owl and I will not be there to do what's right? To turn tide? How long until darkness finally wins?